of random, but these are newly spray painted materials. You can smell them from here through our double mask. He is cheap. He is cheap. They got a bar. I'm about to get some water. There's been a Kanye sighting. The kids are yelling. Social distance is a lot closer. Moving forward, we will be in rooms where the acoustics will be absolutely incredible yes. because I will be involved with the design. No. <laughs> this motherfucker's having an attack, bitch! <laughs> Summer has an expression about education. Summer, go ahead. Now what I'm saying is, no camera flicks, no, no flashes, no moving, no open up Dorito bag. <laughs> All right, summer. Let's go. Okay, so the problem with education, I was saying, is people are marginalized. They're not teaching all of history. They're only teaching it from one perspective, which is the victor's perspective. That's not always the right perspective. And I feel like if we're able to include other people into the perspective and into the conversation, it'll teach the generation coming up how to be more inclusive, how to respond to situations. It'll teach silently if you have another issue that you'd like to bring up. I saw your hand. Oh, yes. Yes. yes, girl. Speak for us. <laughs> she got good attitude. Yes. This is Lauren McCown. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> that, right, 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 right. I'm not trying to quiet your voices, actually. So I don't want to say that in an improper way. I just haven't had the time to word it in the most elegant way possible. So. That's a Stephen move. When Harriet Tubman, well, Harriet Tubman never actually freed the slaves. She just had the slaves go work for other white people. Y'all, we leaving right now. <laughs> you ready? We left. We left. That motherfucker said Harriet Tubman didn't free no slaves. We left. Because it's a joke and it's fine, but I don't want to be in a room that's so disrespectful. It, it don't match my brand. It don't fit my spirit. We, but I'm glad we experienced. I, I I had the experience. Yes, of course. And I think that's fine and that's fair. But when niggas start saying shit that I really just don't agree with, just like uh -uh. it's like being in a in a racist room. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't be in a room with a racist, so I'm gonna be in this room with Kanye because I know he says crazy things sometimes. Oh, this motherfucker say crazy shit all the time. Yeah, if you let okay. him talk, he gets if you let him talk, he gonna he gonna he's, get outraged. He's not gonna say anything. I don't need to be there. He ain't gonna say nothing. This is in the nothing. room drinking and doing coke in the back. Do you need to be in that house? No, you need. <laughs> They're doing cocaine in the backyard.